Okay, hey guys, uh, Kayla here. I just um, wanted to do a makeup tutorial on the look I have here. Um, it's kind of just nice, simple, kind of, I wouldn't call it smoky, but it's nowhere near bright. So, um, yeah, it's just simple, everyday look. Um, and if it's too extravagant for, extravagant for everyday, then it can just be for, you know, nighttime look, whatever. Um, it's really easy to do. Um, and all of the products I'm using, I actually bought in a drugstore or, um, I think, um, at like, um, I don't remember where my mom got the palette. Um, but yeah, pretty much everything you can get just in, in, a, in a store. You don't have to order it online. Nothing super expensive. Um, so yeah, uh, hope you enjoy. And, uh, if you want this look, just keep watching. Um... So I have my brushes, and um, they're all Eco Tools. I just got them at Walmart or Target or something like that. Um, it's the five-piece set eyeliner brush. Um, I'm not a big fan of it. It's I don't know. It's, I just don't like it. Um, I also use this Perfect Point Plus. Um, eyeliner pencil. This is actually in the color very black, or oh, black onyx. If you can see it, it's right here. Yeah. Um. And the mascara I use is just this. It's CoverGirl, and it's there we go. Clump Crusher. It's Lash Blast. Um, and for eyeshadows, I use a few different ones. It just depends on what kind of mood I'm in. And uh, this one, it's Hard Candy. And, um, yeah, it's called Intergalactic. I'm not sure why it's called that because it's not black, but, you know, it's brown. Um, my liquid foundation is Maybelline Fit Me. Three, color 360, it's, um, yeah, Mocha, you can see it, the rest of the information is back here, um, for my powder, I have a Fit Me powder, but it's a little bit heavy, um, so I don't use it too often, um, the Fit Me powder, same color, Mocha, looks like this, um, This. And um, under the powder is the, well, that's where the sponge is supposed to be, but I don't use it, so I took it out and threw it away. Um, I have a couple different powders, um, depends on what makeup I'm using, but um, I love this one. It is Milani um, Powder Foundation, color Creamy Cocoa. You can see, yeah. Um, and then I use this CoverGirl stuff. Um, in number 125, Translucent Tawny. I don't know, I don't like it because it's really sparkly and it's weird. Um, and then to add more color to that brown, I have this color palette by e.l.f. Eyes, Lip Space. Um, has a lot of colors in it. Um, yeah. It's like this inside. Um, okay. Um, I have a couple eyebrow pencils. This is the one I use the most. It's actually an eyeliner pencil, but um, I use it on my eyebrows because it just works very well. Um, this is the other eyebrow pencil that I have. Looks like this. Yeah, um, this is just, I think this is Maybelline. I never remember, but it's old, so it lasts a long time. Um, 
Okay, let's get started. So, spilled it everywhere. Um, yeah, you know, these things, um, maybe a little weird. The reason that I use an eyebrow pencil, because I don't, it's not that I need it, but, um, when I put my makeup on, it lightens my eyebrows, um, I don't know how well you can see them, but the makeup gets in them and makes them like a weird light color and it just looks funny. So I um, use my pencil to kind of darken them like so. Just kind of fill them in a bit. So I don't want to have like super light eyebrows. Like so. Let's see. I mean, they don't look too different, but since it's a webcam, you can't see all the details. Yeah. Oops. We're a little bit low. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, um, as you can see, this eyebrow here has an arch. This one just kind of bleh. Uh, my eyebrows have always been like that, and I don't want to, like, get rid of a bunch of hair on my eyebrows. Um, but they're just naturally like that. They both have, one has an arch and one does not. It's, yeah, way of life, I guess. <laughs> okay, um, so next I'm going to do my eyeshadow, but, um, I don't have any liquid eyeliner, so I do have to use my, either my gel or my, um, stick, the pencil stick. Um, I don't use, I don't like using them on the top, um, only on the bottom, but I am going to have to today, um, start off my, I don't know if it's the blending brush or what, but, you know. I mean, yeah, like this. Finished product. Okay, well, now I can pull my hair down. Um, because I don't wear my hair back like that. Um, just when I'm getting my makeup done. Um, yeah, uh, brush pretty much flattens it all out, um, makes it not so poofy, um, and this is my normal routine on the daily, um, I mean, um, I did, I was going to show you how I do my hair, but there's no point, all I did was straighten it today, so, um, I mean, it's still kind of 
flat on my bangs. Um, I try to get those not so flat, um, but you know, what can you do? Um, yeah, so I'll put a link um, or put down everything I use in the description box. And um, if you like this video, subscribe and, and everything. And um, I'm going to have, since this is my first video, um, I'm going to see what the response is. Then I'll get my page up on Facebook and Twitter and everything if um, I get a good, good response to this. Um, if you have any suggestions of what you want to see, um, please let me know. Um, I'm actually going to be dyeing my hair here. Um, just putting a little streak in it um, so that I can... I don't know, a little different. Maybe put some red in it. Um, because my hair's been like this my whole life. Nothing's changed. Um, so, yeah. Um, just tell me what you think. If you think a little red would look good or not. Um, I don't really know. I haven't, I've had the box for like a month and I haven't done anything with it yet. <laughs> so, uh, just let me know what you think. Bye. Hey guys, Kayla here. I just wanted to show you a really quick and really cool way to get lip color if you don't, um, if you can't find a good shade for yourself or if you just don't know where to start. Um, what I did for a little while, um, it is not perfect. It doesn't last through like drinking or anything like that. It's just, in t just to get you by. Um, and I do it when I need to leave in a rush in the morning or I can't find my lipstick or whatever um, I just chapstick any kind will do um, here I have chapstick the cake batter I don't know can you see that yeah cake batter um, chapstick I mean um, just generically and um, put on a good amount um, and what you want to do after that is get a lip brush if you have one. Buy something little than that. Um, which I do. I just need to relocate it. Here we go. Right here. Lip brush. And um, you just pick a color. Actually, eyeshadow. Believe it or not. Um, this is my eyeshadow palette. Um, and it just depends on the color you want. But I am going to use this one right here. I don't know if you can see it. This is kind of reddish one. Um, it's not super, super sparkly. Oops, pointed to the wrong one. This one. And um, it's like a purple red color. And you just kind of dab it on your lips and it'll give it some color to last you. Like so. might have to do a darker one so you can see it. Um, I don't know, can you see it? Um, I mean, I should probably use a different color so you can see it. Um, it's hard to tell. I don't know, can you see it? I can see it, so I'm hoping you can see it. Um, something like this. There we go. There, see? Um, pretty simple, nice and quick. Um, just basically if you run out of lipstick or whatever, even if you don't have any and you just want to test out colors. I don't know, that's what I used it for at first. Um, and, um, yeah. So, um, this is basically what I did. Um, I just did my eye makeup, my whole makeup tutorial. Um, 
for my face and my eyes. Um, and this is my lip tutorial because I did not add it in for whatever reason. Um, and so I'm going to see if I can't fix that. But um, this is my lip tutorial. If you liked it, please subscribe and like and down there, on the button down there. <laughs> Just let me know. Bye.